I have something I want to tell you. I'm sorry if I seem uninterested or I'm not listening or I'm indifferent. Truly, I ain't got no business here. But since my friends are here, I just came to kick it. Hello and welcome to Plus Size by Default. If you don't know where you are by now, this is as well as it gets in my book. This video is going to be a lot different from the videos that I've made so far on my channel. Um, I want to talk about confidence. A lot of girls on my Instagram tend to DM me or write on my pictures and they're like, oh, I love how confident you are and, you know, like, it, I, I've even got some girls to tell me that, like, the way I love myself helps them love their self. And I don't know whether to take that as a good thing or a bad thing. But it's like, you shouldn't feel that way. You should just love yourself. Like, it, it took me a while to get to the level that I'm at now. I haven't always been so uppity like, oh yeah, da, da. I haven't always been myself. You know, because as growing up, you're trying to fit in. You don't want to be the kid that gets teased by everybody, you know. But I just so happen to be the big tall girl in every class from like kindergarten to like now for real though so after a point it's like yo just be you like you can't really it's no hiding it's like for example boom okay I don't have an example but <laughs> I'm just saying like y'all get where I'm coming from you gotta really think of yourself as nothing but positive like just your lifestyle don't if you think negative negative will happen and I've learned that nobody respects themselves or respects the next person and a lot of it is stemming from social media everybody want to be famous like how long do you expect to last in a world where people will rip you to shreds over like the sl slightest comments you had thousands of people ripping you to shreds over something that you you might have said by accident. So you might as well take the heat for some shit that you really about, you know, if you really about that life. Don't be getting yourself into some shit that you don't know nothing about. I done seen it happen, like, girl. I know we all got the shade room. The shade room be tearing people to shreds. And them people on Instagram and nothing better to do up, and, up on them comments. Girl, uh-uh-uh. If someone ever tells you to stop being yourself, leave that person alone. Like, seriously. You want to be around people that are nothing but positive. You want to be around people that do nothing but uplift you. If they hear neg something negative come out your mouth, what you doing? What, you feel me? Watch your mouth. They not saying they like, yeah, girl. Like, you'll be like, yeah, I don't like my hair today. you be like... Yeah, it's a lot. like you know, let me know if it look crappy for real though. But not don't be trying to make me feel bad about it. Just be like, yo, it do look a little crazy, but let's fix it up a little bit. You know, like you don't want to be around a bunch of haters. Not, not cool. Oh my God, this is the funniest thing ever. Everybody now is a BBW. Oh my God, everybody is a big beautiful woman now. Drake done made it hot now. Oop, dropped it. Stop it. Okay. BBW is not a style. It is a lifestyle. Okay? People have to live like this every day. This is not some, oh, I, like at first it was shame to the devil if you're fat. Oh, you better not be fat. Da -da -da -da. It's still like that because, you know, fat, fat bitches is not in completely where, like, semi-acceptable, which is fucking horrible. And it's, it's really disrespectful and upsetting that... We get disrespected like that. We people too. Like, are you serious? If it was that easy for me to just lose it, oh, trust me, I'll take it off like it was a fat suit. But it's not that easy. It's like, I like to eat. Food is my friend. Food doesn't hurt me. Well, it does in the long run. But it ain't hurting me right now. Is it? Maybe. But anywho. <laughs> yeah, I'm talking about What a lot of people don't tend to realize is that the prettiest girls have the most insecurities like the 
she could be, excuse my language, because my mom hates when I start cursing on my channel. But she got to understand, like, this is supposed to be my channel. I can do what I want. But anyway, <laughs> um, the baddest bitches got the most insecurities. Like, do you not see what these girls do for attention? Just, and you pretty. Like, you got them already, girl. Like, you don't even have to do much. And you just doing too much. It's like using money to buy fake money. Why would you do that? Anyway. So, <laughs> what a lot of you need to learn is being by yourself can really be like vacation. Like being away from a lot of people, not having any friends or not being in a relationship or, you know, not really being around your family if they stress you out or whatever case may be. Um, being by yourself can really help you focus and it can really help you get in tune with yourself. Um... Because, like, for example, I find people to be very distracting. I can be happy one moment and then I can be mad one moment. So, that led me to be by myself. And I learned that maybe it's good to be by myself because I don't get into trouble. I don't get into arguments. I don't fight. I don't. Nothing goes wrong with myself because I'm me. Another thing. Cancel out the opinions of other people what everybody else got to say about you does not matter who does who pay your bills who put food in your mouth who feed you for real though like who feed you you feed you right you do this right okay because i know we not five years old got mommy put, okay think about that like nobody does for you at the end of the day you gotta live in your body it's not like we out here switching souls or we out here just like, okay, well, one day I'm going to live as TT. So let me just jump in her body. No. You got to live like you. Love you. Stop letting everybody determine what's, what's going on in your, in your life. Like, then another thing a lot of people have is nobody. I mean, I see nobody. Not a lot of people notice that fashion and celebrities and music have a huge influence on our lifestyles. Not my lifestyle. Because I do what I want. But a lot of people, they do have a huge influence on their lifestyle. And it sucks because I wish everybody, if every, if the world was full of people that were actually walking around how they were created, the world would be a better place. In all honesty, that's how I feel. But like I said, everybody has their own opinion. I just want you to know that can't nobody hurt you unless you allow them to. Somebody told me, I don't remember who. It probably is like a, a phrase that everybody's heard of. Do not allow somebody to rent space in your head. Who who is anybody paying bills? So why? Why are you here? Or do you pay bills? And why are you here? That simple. If they're not doing anything positive for you, they don't need to be around you. We are at a stage in life where we're trying to get ahead. We're trying to move forward. If you're trying to get on that boat, if you're trying to get this boat rolling with me, thank you. Let's let's get this cracking. But if you're not trying to do what I'm... You got to go. And in, this, in, in the last two months of my life so far, like the ones that just passed, I really became really motivated. And I'm just like, yo, I got to get it done. It's, it's not going to just pop out the air and happen. You got to make it happen. If, especially if you want to survive. We can't hold the And it's what? 70 degrees? 60 degrees on Christmas? Are you kidding me? You already know it's time to get it together, boo-boo. <laughs> like, for real. It's, girl. I have something I want to tell you.